Okinawa's long and varied history of interaction with outside cultures has impacted almost everything, including architecture. Okinawa's architecture incorporates Chinese, Japanese, and Southeast Asian influence. In 1429, the unification of the Ryukyu Kingdom had been made complete. Trade relations blossomed with the Ming emperors of China. An influx of emissary and trade workers began to arrive on the shores of Okinawa. This brought new methods of architecture. In April of 1609, the invasion force of the Shimazu clan began to dismount. 100 warships were sent from Kagoshima to annex the island. By order of the Ryukyu king, he told his subjects not to fight the invading forces. The Japanese had arrived. Although preserving its independence, Okinawa had become a tributary state of China and Japan. The benefit to Okinawa was the new modes of construction. Through Chinese and Japanese innovation, wood-framed houses, known as Nuchija, became popular with the lords of each territory. Tiled with a distinct red-orange earthenware, the tiles connoted status and land ownership. The vassals were forbidden to have tiled roofs and often used thatch or short boards. These homes are called Anaya, made up the majority of the dwellings outside of Naha. To find out more about architecture or anything else about Okinawa, pick up the latest issue of Okinawa Living. Reporting for High Sai Okinawa, I'm Gabriel Archer.